when a lot of these comments started flooding in, I started to do my own research on the hot comb. And Madam C.J. Walker is actually not the inventor of the hot comb. Um, Francis something something is. He's a French man. He invented it. Not that that has anything to do with it. Obviously, I know that this is primarily now. Now I pri now I know that this is primarily used on black women's hair. I literally didn't know one or the other. I found it on TikTok shop. I was like, oh, it's a comb. Cool. Now I've been hearing rumblings on TikTok about how this Becky discovered a brand new hair tool to help her keep her edges down and straighten her hair. Well, as it turns out, that brand new hair tool has been in existence for many, many years in the black community. Welcome back to Marcus at Work Media. So I'm going to pull up some of the clips. I'm going to pull up the original clip from the girl and then some of the feedback from, you know, people in our community, how they respond to it. Let's get right into it. I ordered something new. This came incredibly quick. I literally ordered it two days ago and it was not supposed to get here until like the 12th and then it just showed up. So that's really cool. Now, why did I get it? So I got it because I was straightening my hair the other week and I was showing you guys the straightener that I got. And I love the straightener, I really do. And I'm still gonna use the straightener, but everyone was saying use a comb, it'll make it less frizzy. Then I was shopping on TikTok shop and I saw this and I was like, oh, that's perfect because then it will be like a heated comb, like heat, so I don't have to put the hair straightener and the comb and I could just do it with one. Anyway, once my hair's dried a little bit more, I'm gonna give this a try because I'm actually really excited. So stay tuned. Y'all. Are you kidding? This took me like two seconds. Oh my. Hey, can I interrupt the video real quick to point out how excited she is <laughs> for this development? I mean, wow, but hey, don't mind me. That's really freaking cool. It was very good for my hair. I know a few of you guys have ordered it as well. Let me know what you think of it because I definitely definitely recommend it. If there's not a little link right here, you should be able to find it. It, it should be right here. If it's not, you should be able to find it on the TikTok. Show. That's suspicious. That's weird. <laughs> hey, yo, hey, yo, hey, yo. <laughs> she, she really thought she found something brand new, man. <laughs> Meanwhile, black girls is like, do the hokey pokey and turn your big ass around and get the fuck back to your fucking seat. The fuck is wrong with your ashy ass? Okay, let's talk about this and this comment and the hundred other comments that are on these other videos. Some people are really upset. Some people are absolutely not upset. Some people are calling me all these names. Some people are being racist. Some all sorts of things. So I just, I really want to talk about it because first of all, four days ago, I, four days ago, yeah, I didn't know that hot combs even existed. Hey, yeah, she did try to bag it up, but like, hey, you know, I've never, I've never heard of it. You know, this, you know, the the, 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 the black people are saying, you know, this and they're saying that, you know, I just didn't know. I just didn't know. Um, I mean, if you've been in a, in a dark hole for many, many years, maybe you haven't heard, but I mean, it had to have come up in some way or some fashion, whether in media, songs, you know, if you've been around black people, have you? you would know but <laughs> i digress let's get into some of the feedback well they done found something new they found the bonnets and now they done found the hot comb good lord <laughs> <laughs> they done found the hot and what did she say what did she say i didn't know this even existed until what TikTok. Something we've been using since what? Childhood. I know every black woman remembers they mama putting that comb on the stove because you were scared. You were scared. You were terrified. You had to hold your ear. Getting burned. Mm-hmm. Here we go with this shit again. You got black folks on my For You page talking about this white girl using a hot comb on her hair and if she bald headed after she used a flat on, I bet you she won't use it again. I bet you she won't use it again, but that's not of our business. Like, if anything, we can tell her, hey, you know, use it on the lowest heat, use some heat protectant. We can educate her instead of trying to bash her. Cause I'm 100% black and I'm sick of black folks trying to always clamp some shit. Like, yes, it did come from black folks, but why the fuck else can't nobody else use it? Like, nobody is trying to take 
from us like if something works for them that's what they're gonna use like just like when you install in a wig or something you you gotta pick and choose which products work best for laying a wig on you like what the f is the problem with another race using something that that you use on yourself if it works for them it works for them and they're gonna continue to use it so i don't i don't really understand the problem